Hey Cougs, my name is Chirag Mungnik, and welcome back to At UH Entertainment. The Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo just began on February 27th. The opening night featured Blake Shelton at Energy Stadium in his first rodeo appearance since 2018. His wife, Gwen Stefani, also made an unexpected guest appearance, and the two sang their new duet, Purple Irises. The event will be held for 20 days until the rodeo finally ends on March 17th, with singer Eric Church closing out the festivities. Other performances slated for the event include 50 Cent, Major Lazer, Bun B, and the Jonas Brothers. Tickets are still available, so be sure to check out the event if you're interested. A shocking new documentary entitled Where is Wendy Williams chronicles Williams' life since the wrapping of her show. The documentary goes into detail about Williams' mental health issues and trouble with the court-ordered financial guardianship requested by Williams Bank in 2023. Williams was diagnosed with primary progressive aphasia and frontotemporal dementia. Her struggle with these diseases are documented in the film and have garnered some controversy, with Variety criticizing the show as, quote, unnecessary and exploitative, end quote. The latest AP Men's College basketball poll places the University of Houston in the first place. The Cougars beat Iowa State 73-65 to and they beat Baylor 82-76 to to unseat the number one team at the time, the University of Connecticut. The University of Houston also leads in the Net and Ken Palms rankings, so there's a lot riding on the Cougs this semester. The next game takes place this Saturday on March 2nd against the Oklahoma Sooners. We at Coug TV wish them all the very best for their upcoming away game. This year's South by Southwest festivals will begin on March 8th and will last through to March 16th. This year there's slated to be 115 feature films premiering at the event. Headlining the film festival are movies such as Alex Garland's Civil War, Pamela Adlon's Babes, Kyle Mooney's Y2K, and Dev Patel's Monkey Man. Last year, the attendance for the film festival exceeded 16,000 people. And this year's event looks like it may have even more attendees. The festival will take place in Austin over spring break. Be sure to stay tuned for more coverage. That's all for this episode of At UH Entertainment. My name is Chirag Mungnaik. Thanks for watching Coog TV.